Greetings, Washington Street. For today's devotional, I'd like to focus on the verse Micah 6, 8. I know most of you are familiar with this verse, but I'm going to read it just to remind you. He has shown you, O mortal, what is good. And what does the Lord require of you? To act justly and to love mercy and to walk humbly with your God. I think in today's world, these words are more profound to me than ever. What does God want us to do? And how does God want us to do it? What does God want me as an individual to do? The Creator has given each of us gifts and talents to make a difference in our community and the entire world. Each of us strive to find our own path to act justly, love mercy, and walk humbly. One of the many aspects I love about Washington Street is the willingness to find, for us to find a way as a congregation to strive to fulfill these words. Our history is one of bright spots in fulfilling this charge and dark ones when we turned a blind eye on these words. We are not perfect individually, and we are not perfect as a congregation. At this point in the life of our church, we are trying to find our role in eliminating racism, especially systemic racism in our community. Our racial justice action team is engaged in justice effort. I think the answer ultimately boils down to what we do individually. How do we seek justice? How do we create a world where all human beings have the opportunity to develop fully? More specifically, how do we change our community so people of color feel safe and have the opportunity to fully use their talents and gifts? My prayer is that individually and collectively, we can ensure our community acts justly has mercy, and walks humbly. I'd like to close with the refrain from one of my favorite hymns. It brings tears to my eyes when we sing this in our sanctuary. But it's, Here I am, Lord. Here I am, Lord. Is it I, Lord? I have heard you calling in the night. I will go, Lord, if you lead me. I will hold your people in my heart. Amen.